Okay, guys. Recent trip to the local international market. Now, our international market is primarily Asian, but we found some pretty interesting stuff that some of it will go in meal kits, some of it will be taste testing. Uh, my daughter found these uh, Hello Kitty biscuit sticks. They're strawberry cream. Uh, they're like a pocky kind of. We got some chocolate tea biscuits. This sounds interesting. Sunflower crackers that are pizza flavored. Now, they make a lot of these jelly type uh, jars of, you know, these little packets of jelly. And this one happens to be a yogurt. They've got some interesting flavors here. We've got a strawberry. This one I thought was kind of cool. It's a, a milk flavor. Blueberry. Melon. And that's mango. There weren't any pineapple in here, as they showed. I guess it's a random fill on these. Now, then we also found these jelly straws or jelly strips. They're like little tubes of jelly. Uh, we've got four flavors. What have we got? We got lychee, pineapple, strawberry, and grape. Those could be interesting. Canned coffee. We got the cappuccino variety. There were four, but we uh, kind of already rated one. And uh, it's really good stuff. Now, we make a lot of meal kits, and sometimes we do them specific to a culture. I've bought a whole bunch of these preserved vegetables. Uh, they're not very expensive. And with some ramen or rice or something, can actually make a really good side dish. Really interesting thing we found were uh, Asian Pringles. We've got seaweed flavor, that's the green one. Uh, Asian ham, looks like bacon to me. And cucumber flavor. They also make something called uh, mixed congee. We got two varieties. And uh, unfortunately, I'll have to eat all of them by myself because they're made with peanut and my kiddo's allergic to peanuts. Interesting three-in-one coffees. It's got the coffee, the milk, and the sweetener in it. Uh, we got two varieties. They're supposed to be like double strength on some of them. That's uh, one brand. This is the other brand. They come in really large bags. They're not very expensive. A little bit of hot water, and you've got a proper meal, or a proper drink, I should say. Uh, every Asian meal that I have has to have fortune cookies. We bought a bag of that. Now, I was mentioning ramen. These are the least expensive that you can normally find. And they're uh, dry. They come in a block, so you don't have to worry about a cup getting crushed or whatever. Uh, some other stuff we've been doing for our meal packs is, because uh, we I make meals for two people for either a full day or for uh, one meal. We found some of these Jello singles. You just mix them with milk. I'm thinking powdered milk and water. Should work. Uh, they've got uh, these Nature Valley biscuits with almond butter. This is cinnamon almond butter flavor. And then, of course, you've got your Pop-Tarts. Ocean Spray makes a blueberry cranberry snack medley. And you, know, you can throw those in with like a packet of oatmeal and... Uh, make, uh, you know, a, 
fruity oatmeal, or just eat them as a snack. It's a lot of drink tubes out on the market uh, from like cranberry lemonade. Uh, I've got root beer and cream soda here. These were uh, some that we just got today. All you need is a bottle of water, dump the tube in, shake it up, you're good to go. Meal replacements are always a good deal. Drink that, you get you some protein, everything you pretty much need, uh, your carbs and all that. More on the drinks, uh, hot drinks. Uh, you can get like apple cider, you can get hot chocolate, lots of different varieties, lots of hot teas. Uh, these boxes like the uh, cranberry lemonade I showed you, you can get coffee and there's like four or five varieties in that bag. I keep them together. You can get powdered creamers. They're a lot easier than trying to carry those little cups around that splatter all over your meal kit. Uh, here's a snack. It's uh, the uh, cheese that's snapped. They're pretty cool. I'm gonna move this one out of the way so I got a little bit of room. Uh, for actual entrees, we've got a bunch of these. Uh, Hormel Complete, Salisbury Steak, Chicken Alfredo, Beef Pot Roast, Swedish Meatballs, Spaghetti and Meat Sauce, and Turkey and Dressing. Now, the reason that I can buy all these different varieties is because the kiddo and I, we like different things. I can customize it. Uh, we picked up a couple more of these Velveeta Cheesy Bowls. This is Ultimate Cheeseburger Mac. Now, I was talking about cereal. This is cream of wheat, but you can get oatmeal, grits, all kinds of stuff in these packets. Throw a couple of those in. You can make a good hot breakfast. This one here, I don't think would survive in the heat, but they're little boxes of chocolate-covered raisins, or chocolate-flavored yogurt-covered raisins in this case. Uh, the chocolate raisins I had in the truck melted all together into a block the other day. You can get uh, fruit strips. These are basically fruit bars, peanut butter crackers, or cheese crackers. Slim Jims are always good. I caught a good sale on these and I uh, bought like five boxes. So I've got plenty of those. And uh, some uh, crackers are always good to have a couple of those in your meal kit for snacks. And uh, you can take some cheese spread or potted meats, deviled ham, chicken salad. You got a good lunch snack right there. So uh, you don't have to go out and buy these big kits that are already pre-made. You can make your own really cheap and uh, customize them the way you want them. So uh, that's just some of the new stuff that's going in to uh, the different meal packs.